Jen, my first and unfortunately also the last here at Belle Isle. The, the, the atmosphere is absolutely electric here. The, the, the second we stepped over here in Belle Isle, we could even see the feel the vibration on the ground as the, the, the cars are practicing at the moment. And while they're practicing, people have already started to come here. Thousands of people are expected in attendance today and tomorrow. And of course, what do we do with people? People like to eat. And I've got Chef Ap Apit over here who's going to be walking me through how he creates his magical powers <laughs> in order to get all this food ready. 10,000 people in yeah. two days. How is this mission working out for you? Well, it's been going fantastic. This is our 10th year in a row here on Diamo Catering and Event Management. So we're excited to be here again in our 10,000 square foot kitchen here, as you can see, um, you know, set up. You know, as much as you'd like it to be, we thought uh, running water, full electricity and plumbing. So uh, all the magic happens in here today, for example, we're doing Nashville Southern Fried Chicken Sandwiches. So this process actually started a couple days ago. All natural, hormone-free, antibiotic-free chicken breasts. We brought them in fresh, we butchered them all. We soaked them in buttermilk for a couple days. We made a beautiful floured rub here. As you can see, our crew behind us, they're working all the chicken here coming out of the buttermilk going into the flour it's getting fried fresh to order so today we'll be serving probably about 5,000 of these Nashville chicken sandwiches house made pickles we cure and pickle our own uh, cucumbers here our own homemade Nashville hot sauce and then we're gonna make a big slaw here tomatoes uh, lettuce red onions to build all the sandwiches to order so it's it's quite a production here you know you can see the pallet jack in the background and all the things they don't teach you in culinary school, right? How to drive a high-low and how to move your food around on pallets. But Absolutely magical. How many people you got working over here today? So we have a, a plethora of people. Today we're starting to, um, you know, tone down a little bit because we prep all week and today's all execution. So all my staff now is in the five kitchens around the island. So they'll be building. We're going to send them the chicken sandwiches and then they'll build them all in their chalet. So right now we've got probably two to three hundred people dispersed around the island right now getting ready. Breakfast is already getting finished up. We'll be starting lunch service about 12 o'clock. So it's an exciting time here in Detroit and it all happens. I tell you, it starts with Roger Penske at the top, um, exudes excellence and then it just kind of trickles down from there. There's a, a, a camaraderie on this island, a, a sense of teamwork and family that makes everybody come together, the plumbers, the electricians, the, the tents, and the rental people, and everybody comes together and we make this event happen. And there's- Absolutely amazing. Uh, thank yeah. you so much. And listen, I know this is gonna be a nostalgic moment for you because this is the last one here in Belle Isle. Yep. And everyone's gonna be loving it because they're gonna make sure that they make this the most memorable race ever. And once we come back, Jen, we're gonna be talking more about the race, more what you can do, and do not miss it. Because remember, this is the last one taking place here at Belle Isle. Jen, back to you.